Hi and welcome back to the second and final video for today. For this I've signed into the Fiction Shifter Twitter account and I'm just going to show you how to do a tweet. So obviously today is the first day of this challenge so that is a great thing to put in a tweet. Uh, it's factual and hopefully people will uh, retweet it. Let me explain what I mean by that. So a tweet is a very short message, 140 characters or less. And bear me one second while I just type this in. So, as you can see, that's just a very short tweet, and hopefully people will retweet it, which means share it. Uh, so I'm going to just go ahead and click tweet, like so, and there you can see I am Fiction Shifter. This is your username, by the way, the username that you set up when you created the Twitter account. That's why it's quite important that it's uh, relevant. So may take you a little bit of time to get that right, but it's definitely worthwhile. So people can now see this tweet. They can... I was... What's going on there? I obviously can't uh, share my own tweet, but if I saw... Let me go down. If I saw a tweet that I found interesting, then I can just click on retweet which basically is Twitter terms for sharing a tweet with your followers. Okay, so that's really something we'll come on to a bit further on in the course. Uh, but basically, that is how you create a tweet. Now, I'm just going to go to my tweets very quickly before we finish. Just to give you an idea of the kind of things that are worthwhile putting as a tweet. Ideally, it needs to be factual information. Come on, computer. There you go. Ideally, it needs to be factual information that you don't really want to generate any discussion on. Um, so, for example, the free writing course, you can see I've put little quotes. Go down. Um, there's links to a YouTube video. Um, Factual stuff here, things like this. Smash words can now deliver your purchases to your Dropbox account. Information that your uh, visitors or your followers on Twitter will find interesting. 